guys, Regan Grimes here, IFBB Pro. Just got back from my fasted cardio, so I usually do about 50 minutes on the stairs, elliptical, or the treadmill in the morning. I wake up, 7.30, get up, go to the gym for uh, 8 o'clock, usually hit some poses, see how I'm looking. I take my weight before I get to the gym, right when I wake up, so I know it's like precise, and you just keep that, checking your weight every single day. Um, leading into the show, send it off to the coach, take the posing video, send it off to the coach, and uh, we do that every day leading into the show. We're now currently uh, seven weeks out, um, and yeah, so I just got back, finished up uh, my breakfast here, had 80 grams of oatmeal with half a cup of blueberries, two whole eggs, and five ounces of chicken. Great breakfast, love it, and then uh, actually train after this meal, so... But before I train, I'm going to uh, rip some games. I play uh, Call of Duty Warzone with buddies. Uh, I love that. I've always actually been a bit of a gamer, and uh, I, I enjoy it. On prep especially, because like, it helps you kill time in between you know, uh, meals and whatnot. So you know, I'll play a couple of games, maybe 30, 45 minutes, and uh, then we'll head off to the gym. Yeah, I wanted to give a shout out to this product right here, Z-Mag T. This is unbelievable for sleep. Uh, I've always had trouble... like. Like I said, I'm a gamer. I like to stay up late. I end up playing and I'm like, oh no, it's like 1 in the morning or 1.32 in the morning. So I had to fix that. Can't be staying up that late. And uh, this product helped me do that. So what I did instead around like 10.30, I popped this product right here. I mean, at 11 o'clock, I'm feeling sleepy, lay in bed and just pass right out. This is much deeper sleep and it helped me reset my, my sleeping pattern. So now, you know, I go to bed around 11, 12 at the latest and I get up every day, 7.30. It's crazy once you actually get yourself in a good routine. I wake, my, my body wakes up now like 7.20, like right before the alarm even. Uh, so I, I thought that's kind of cool, but it feels a lot better to be on a schedule where you know you get up early in the morning, get after it, get your shit done, and then you know staying up super late and then waking up late is just a, not a good routine for, for body. When you want to get up, get your stuff done, get the food in, and you have longer hours within the day to do so. Morning for breakfast, I have my men's multi plus test. So two capsules of this I take down, um, just have it with my meal. So I don't have this, uh, you know, before fasted cardio or anything like that. We'll get to that next, but uh, this is all your essential vitamins in there. So make sure you have two of these with your breakfast and you'll be taking care of all the essentials there. This guy right here, L-carnitine. I take these right before I head off to do my fasted cardio. So I wake up in the morning, I uh, get nice ice water, my GAT shaker, and I put actually one scoop of Flex EAAs, so it keeps me anabolic, keeps me uh, hydrated in the morning. And then, I, like I said, I have my L-carnitine, which is a fat burning product, non-stimulant formula. Um, and then what I like to do is just on my way to the gym, I just sip a little bit of coffee. It seems to be enough for me, and I just love my morning coffee, so um, I rock with that. PS5 here. Um, I've always ripped PS5. Actually, funny story. Uh, when I when I went away to college, I was always an Xbox guy because I loved Halo, right? Um, and when I went away to college, I lived uh, in London, Ontario, close to Fanshawe College, and kind of like a bit of a sketchy area. Like it's all students and just like just a lot of shenanigans going on there. But anyways, uh, I think first year we got broken into and someone stole my Xbox. And then at the time, a couple of buddies were doing play, having PlayStation, and I uh, made the switch. So ever since, I've been a PlayStation PlayStation guy. But yeah, I do miss the Halo. If Halo ever came out for PlayStation, that'd be pretty cool. But, yeah. What is this? So here's my Jimmy rigged uh, stand for <laughs> the, the light. <laughs> so sometimes I, I actually do have a Twitch. Um, it's called Re it's Reading Grimes uh, Live. It's called Green Grimes Live on Twitch. So I do it sometimes, not very often. I just find that like I enjoy gaming as like kind of a, of a like a downtime type thing. And you know, not that I don't like to, you know, socialize and, and talk with you guys or whatever on there. It's just like I like to I get like right into the game, right? So I just like if you're talking and you know playing, you're not focusing and I just I just like to get right into the game, but yeah. So first person shooters is for me. Call of Duty Warzone, um, 
is, is the big one right now. Apex is awesome. I used to play that a lot. I'm just kind of going back and forth. Uh, some of the big uh, Twitch streamers like Nick Merckx, uh, I've seen that he was going back to Apex, kind of inspired me to go back and play some of that. So I do enjoy that as well. Don't gamer probably like, well, who is this nerd? You know? But yeah, I have the, the camera here. So you set the camera up. Then I can turn the light on. Got the headset. That's so cool. Do words on. Then yeah, I got, when I do Twitch, like so, I can at least uh, look it up on the the computer here, and I can watch the stream, and I can see your guys' comments while I'm uh, actually playing. Episode 2 is about to commence. Here we are. We're going to train some arms today. It's going to be an interesting workout. I'm going to be doing that with Dorian and his brother Noah. So Dorian, if you didn't know, is my coach. He's been my coach for years. And he's also the owner of this massive gym here, Pure Muscle and Fitness. It's, uh, I would say, like the only way to compare it would be to the oxygen gyms out in Kuwait. Um, but yet it's here in Canada. So we're very, very lucky and uh, blessed to be able to train in such a wicked facility. Started here with some, some arms, but first, you know you gotta get your pre-workout in. Get your Pump Tropic. It's a pump formula with uh, Nootropics. So you get a, uh, there is no stims in this. I did have a coffee before. It's kind of like what I prefer to do. If you like even more stims, make sure you stack it with Nitroflex. Everyone knows what Nitroflex is. So you get two scoops here. This flavor is amazing. You got your pineapple, orange, guava. Did I say that right? Guava? I don't know. <laughs> All I know is it tastes great and it gives me a good pump. So, let's mix it up. And let's get after it. Look at my life and it's one in a million Got in a whip and it don't got a ceiling Walk in the crib and look like a museum Hop out of bed, I'm like, damn, what a feeling Came a long way from yeah, the life I was living Put in the work and it stopped for a minute oh, wow. They standing up when I walk in the and, building uh, Look at my life and it's one in a million Yeah so today we're starting off uh, like all biceps, and then we're going to do all triceps. We don't do this every time, but sometimes we do biceps, triceps, and uh, like superset the two. But this time we're going to get a huge pump in the vibe, finish them off, and then do the triceps. Look at my life and it's one in a million. Got in a whip and it don't got a ceiling. Walk in the crib and look like a museum. Hop out of bed, I'm like, damn, what a feeling. Came a long way from the life I was living. Put in the work and it stopped for a minute. They standing up when I walk in the building. Look at my life and it's one in a million. Come on. 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 This is my only two friends in the pen and a pad and I'm putting the magic to work. Uh, I was four four like, going up five pounds every time. And uh, max will be 40. Maybe only get five or six reps. Drop it down to 20. And Keeping them together at the top and then even trying to rotate even a little bit more. So they're kind of like Yeah, I, I feel I feel it's like it's nice because the first like five reps you can, you can get the extra rotation. Yeah. Then as you fail, like, you can just kind of just push the dumbbells them, together. Lock them together. Yeah, yeah, lock them together. I agree. That's nice. literally what I just did because yeah. I was like, Shit, it's good. You can yeah. kind of keep them separated. Yeah. Then once you fatigue, push Those them together. Those reps are, are, are nasty when you like. Yeah, get that extra rotation. Can really rotate, but. Yeah. Okay. I'm 
put the team on my back. I do it all for the family. Everyone that nigga rap. Nobody ever yeah. These curls again, like pretty much every exercise. Yeah. Pull it. Um, we increase the weight every set. Yeah. And then at the end, like four set. Yeah. Do a, a bit of a drop. So here we're hitting the 110s for the curls. And then we'll do a drop down to about yeah. 70. And then we're supersetting it with the reverse curl. And we're doing 60 there. We'll just burn out until it finishes. So it's a three part set for the fourth set. Start the push downs over there. Oh man, six weeks left. This is this is grind time. Grind time or grind time. Whatever you want to call it. I love this part of prep. It's like it hurts, but it's like it feels good and uh, I love like you know putting the effort every day. See there's changes happening every single day. And it comes quick, like within no time, you know, we'll be two weeks out, we'll be flying. A week out, uh, out to Florida, and it'll be showtime. It's, uh, it happens fast, but uh, it's exciting. So I'm excited to bring you guys along with me. This triceps, guys. So first, we're doing uh, tricep push down. It's a light fitness machine. This one I like. You can get it right tight to your body. You can actually turn it in or out. And. Uh, yeah, it's great. So as long as you're keeping the hands inside elbows, you're going to be working the tricep. Well, last year was much different because there was, so there was multiple shows, right? It was a really long season. Mm -hmm. um, but so far this year, like uh, the last couple of weeks, we're making a lot of progress. Last mm -hmm. week was seven weeks out. Now we're six weeks so and uh, one week since we trained arms. I mean, I've noticed like massive difference just in a week. week. You know, Regan's body is pretty responsive. So once he flips the switch and, you know, starts dropping calories or increasing cardio, his body is able to make big jumps. Um, yeah. Like, you know, what the progress that Regan's able to make in a week might be like progress that I would make in three or four weeks. So fresh, like I feel like um, obviously these next six weeks are the grinders. Like uh, I, I, I feel like we're right on point to be like the best, not early. Yeah. Not early, but right on point for show day. Yeah. And I think that's uh, mm -hmm. a good thing. I mean, yeah, it's cool to be, you know, like ready early, but at the same time, like if you're ready uh like too early you're not as fresh looking so yeah i think uh, and that in that showed last year uh competing you know did three Multiple shows, shows in europe and uh, and then did the olympia six weeks later after those three were done so definitely took a toll on the body and uh, this year's definitely going to be different we've added for sure another five to seven pounds of quality and muscle. I, yeah, and I think you just being here in Burlington too, and being at the gym and me being able to see you on a, more of a daily basis and yeah. training together. Like, this is the first yeah, prep we get to train together where we're training time. multiple yeah, times yeah. a week together, seeing awesome. each other. You know what I mean? Pose after the workout. Yeah, I feel like that's gonna turn over, like really transition, right? Yeah. Just the, the, the training intensity this mm -hmm. year. Uh, I think everything's just been elevated for you. Yeah, and I think yeah. we're gonna see that when you know, it comes yeah. time to displaying that on stage. Definitely. So that was a killer workout, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed that. Uh, we'll be bringing you guys another wicked workout coming soon. Grimey out.